Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I just wanted to share a quick demo of this traffic shop counter. So basically, we are counting how many people are getting in and how many people are going out of the shop. It's a very simple retail shop and people are coming in, purchasing stuff and going out. So this uh, something like this is very important and very useful to uh, small shop owners that can basically find out uh, how many people they come in. And here is the interesting part. So if you see this person was not detected when he came in. So I want you to Tell me why exactly that happened. Try to think why this person was not detected. And the rest of them, they are being detected properly. But this person was not detected properly. So I want you to think about this and tell me. And I will share in the comments later on why was this person not being detected properly as well. So as I was mentioning earlier that this is very useful for small shop owners because they will be able to tell how many people come in at what time periods and during different seasons. So data like this is very useful for shop owners so they can uh, decide their strategies based on this information, based on this data. So here you can see whenever the person crosses this region uh, we get an arrow and if it's going in the shop we get a green arrow and if they are going out of the shop then we get a red arrow and you can see the people are being detected properly as well and uh, normal detectors they don't actually detect very good because uh, specifically for this instance we have the person from the top view and the images they are not really trained for top views so what we did we had to train our own uh, model for this custom model and we had our own tracking algorithm for this as well and all of this is running on the web and it is real time as you can see so all of this is covered in our computer vision web development course so and this is in the commercial apps in the last part so uh, computer vision web apps so if you are interested in learning something like this and creating it for your own uh, projects then do check that out uh, links will be in the description below